Let's break some more news. Why don't we talk about the portal a little bit? There's some wild stuff Ooh. going on with that portal. It's been out of hand. I'm team portal. Raise your, are you team portal? I like it. It makes portal? it interesting. Jake, team portal. Corby, team portal. You no, like his it? His hand's not up. Uh, like uh, man, guys. Don't, don't <laughs> be the old school guy. Like, oh, you get, dude, it's awesome. It is so sick for fans that we get it. The whole reason we're, ha- no. like, the reason we're having this show today is because of the damn portal. Is it becoming too much, though? So? Yeah. No. Well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. It's exciting fans. Yes. Great time. I mean, you know, I, I put it, I think maybe in our group or maybe in the discord or something like the day after nationals now transfer portal season. Now the fun begins. Right. And I just don't think everybody realized how big and how this was going to go down this year. I had, I mean, I had a, I had a pretty good idea that it was going to get wild and uh, it's been that way. And I don't, Fan, yeah, exciting, yeah. Overall, growth of the sport, looking at it as a whole, just not good, man. Just not good. I mean, if you're an athletic director, okay, you're sitting here, you're in the MAC conference or whatever, who if you go look on the portal, like Buffalo's got nine guys in the portal, Edinburgh's got seven guys in the portal, um, you know, the MAC's loaded with guys in the portal. You're at a smaller institution, right? And Next thing you know, it's like you get an AA or two portal gone, right? One or two years. It's like sooner or later, your your wrestling program's already losing your money. Okay, your now you can't compete at all because you don't have the money. If you get if you have an AA, somebody swoops in and seventy five hundred K, right? You come on over here for the year, and we need you. And it's yeah, great for us and the fan, but for the longevity of the sport, man, I'm just not sure. I mean. How it's gonna if it's good or bad. I think it's bad. I think we lose programs over it. Um, I mean the rich get richer. I mean, look at Nagao goes in today. Where's everybody think Nagao's going? What's everybody heard? Penn State 133, right? Why do you think Nagao went in the portal? Okay. Do you think it just out of thin air he decided, you know what? I I'm just gonna go to see what's out there. I'm gonna see what's out there. No, guys, it's open season right now. Open season. People call people who call Jake knows a guy who knows a guy who knows a guy. Well, everybody knows a guy who knows a guy who knows a guy. And that guy calls the guy and they say, hey, we know we we know we know a program or we you know, hey, if you go in the portal, there's an opportunity to earn X amount at an NIL deal. It's it's open season. Um, There's no way to stop it. There's no way to say, oh, this pro there it's it's open season. I mean, it's phone call after phone call and, and anybody can do about it. And, you know, I mean, Bernie went in, right? I mean, you think Bernie just went in on a whim? No. I mean, Bernie, I mean, there's stuff going on, right? I mean, I'm not, you know, a lot of teams are out there calling people that, I mean, look at how, how, how many teams have we heard for Shane Griffith in the last couple of weeks, guys? He's not even in the damn portal yet. Yeah, it's not official it's yet. It's open season. It mm-hmm. is open season. I'm talking. We were talking about this in the chat. I say hundred. I say one million can win you a title right now. One million dollars, a hundred k per weight class. You could go out for one year and get a stud for about a hundred k. Now you're probably not going to be able to go out and get Carter or Brooks or any of those guys like that for a hundred k, right? What you know, and Carter too. Come on, Carter out there. He. You used to not say a whole lot. Now he's saying a whole lot. I mean, you know, everybody heard there were bags given out last year, right? RBY made some visits and then, you know, money got matched and RBY stayed. Well, you think that they're not, they're not thinking that same thing. He's just trying to raise the bar. Bernie's out right now traveling. He's at ASU this weekend. He's just raising the bar. That's a, it's a business. You can't blame these kids. Go get that money. Make them pay. You know what I'm saying? If that's the game right now, but it's just shady, right? It's shady. Yeah, when, I mean, I, when I see when I see a guy go to the Big Ten, you know what I think? Oh, it's a business now. If I see a guy go to Big Ten school, I'm like, oh, it's a business now. Like, come on, right? <laughs> Jake, what's your opinion on the portal? Yeah, you know, I think I think the portal. Like, I, I'm with Corby and I'm with with you, Zach. I think the portal is bad for for smaller programs. I think it's probably bad for overall wrestling 
Um, but as a fan, from a fan perspective, you know, which, Sick. which is what I am, it's, it's freaking awesome. You know, mm-hmm. the discord is going crazy. You know, we're, our group chat's going crazy. I've got kids and, and, and people texting me left and right about, Hey, I heard this. I heard that. I heard that. Um, you know, I think overall it's, it's cool. Uh, it's good for those athletes to make money. I think it's, it's important for them. You know, I mean, Bernie, you know, he, he's going to get paid. You know, he's been oh, at, yeah. he's been at yeah, Paul. Yeah, I mean, definitely getting paid. I mean, those guys are going to get paid. I mean, they, they've watched their friends or they've watched people do it before. So, you know, why wouldn't you? I mean, well, why not put your name out there? It's, it's, you know, Shane Griffith. I, I mean, he was in the portal last year, you know, I mean, and then, then he's back at, back at Stanford and, you know, he's probably going to go back in, but uh, I, I, I know a lot of people that, why wouldn't you take visits again? You know, why wouldn't you mm. accept offers or not accept offers, but, but, you know, at least entice them and, and have people, you know, offer you stuff. So I don't know. I, I'm not a fan of it as a wrestling coach, as a, you know, a person who, you know, you know, loyalty, blah, 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 all that, all that kind of stuff. But I think if I was a kid or had a son who, you know, maybe was, wasn't recruited highly, out of high school and then he goes and, and has success. I mean, it's like, okay, I can go to this smaller school and wrestle hard and compete hard and, and go through workouts. And then I, I, you know, I, I just get a scholarship or I can go to Iowa or Penn state or Ohio state or Iowa state or whoever's going to offer me $50,000, whatever that number is. Yeah. I mean, I get paid $50,000 to go train. Like that would Crazy. be awesome. I mean, now with the Nagal news, but you're saying yeah. that he's going to Penn State. Well, I mean, I'm not. I mean, that's that's what that's the rumors out there, right? That he's in the portal and wants to wants to visit Penn State. That's kind of what I'm hearing. I don't know. Um, oh, here's another thing too for people out there that may not know. When you go in the portal, it's just like how you get your five visits. You get five official visits, right? So you can go bop around, right? These older guys are going and. They're getting wined and dined and you know what I mean? Maybe checking out what the chicks look like on the campus they're heading to. You know what I'm saying? They're having a good time. They're out doing it again, right? You're 23, 24, right? Or 22 and you did your you did your visits when you were 18 or whatever. You know, you didn't have real experience or whatever. Now these guys are getting to go out, right? See what's going on. Check out the team. Hang out with the guys. Go out for a nice dinner. Let people spend some money on you. And then, you know, decide. So, I, I mean, I... I'm not, like I said, I'm not totally against it. I'm not, I just, there's only, I mean, we keep hearing, right? Let's, let's do, I mean, do I just throw the teams out there that, I mean, we keep hearing that guys are going to in the portal. I mean, who gives a shit, right? I mean, it's just, everybody knows it. The team, I mean, you pretty much got, you got a lot of the big 10, right? I mean, they're paying a lot of the money, you know, a lot of the NIL, you keep hearing names right now, right? I mean, your guy dressers know, you know, they're, they're, they're in on a lot of guys. You know what I'm saying? They, you know, they got some good NIL stuff going, you know, and that's, I mean, that's, there's nothing wrong with it. Right. But here's the thing. We all know that 10, let's say programs that maybe have some money to throw around. And then we know the 67 or so that just don't, you know what I mean? And so think about that, you know, you're, the percentages and numbers, I mean, they, they're, you just, you can't compete. And so think how discouraging that is for the coach in the mid major that does train a guy up, right? You're in there every day, busting your ass with this guy, training him up. And then man, he's going to go AA and guess what's going to happen. The loyalty is the bag guys. The loyalty is the bag. So like, it's just the reality. So you're going to AA and guess what? That, that mid major just can't pay you. They, I mean, they have a giving day that maybe raises thirty-five, forty thousand dollars a year. That's not. That's half of what it's going to take to go get a, a top AA. But let me ask you this: so everybody that I was talking to was saying that the Harvard guy was a done deal in Michigan. It was like, it was a, it was a next topic type of situation. Lucas Davison mm-hmm. enters the chat, and next thing you know, Michigan's saying, "Who's that guy over there?" And next thing you know, he announces yeah. he's going there. So. Is you think that was a situation where they're like, if you visit anywhere else, you're dead to me? Because that happens. They say if you if you visit anywhere else, the offer's off the table. It's either that or was Michigan like, nah, we'd rather have this guy. I think just nothing's off the table. And if someone pops up who's a better option, schools are going to take them. 
Yeah. I think timing might have got him, right? I think I think it might have just all fell in the timing where he's, you know, thinking, hey, I'm going to go to Michigan. I'm going to go to Michigan. Maybe gets a phone call and thinking, hey, maybe I'll go check this place out. You know, maybe maybe the bag's bigger. Maybe the grad, you know, grad school situation's better. Um, and then while he's there or the day after, right, now Davison hits the portal and boom, he goes. And now, like you said, he's standing looking around like, whoa, you know, where where will he go? Um, you know, Wisconsin needs a heavyweight. They're, they seem to call everybody in the portal, right? You know, Rutgers, right? I mean, that's you know one of the visits he t- he took. So I mean, Rutgers is obviously in play for him as well. And they lost Boone. Now, what's going on with you guys and Boone? You know, they're Heartland NIL involved in that deal or no? I have not nothing to do with that. I have no clue. I hope <laughs> I hope Boone comes to Iowa State. That'd be cool. Yeah, where is Iowa he guy? Land? Shout out to Boone. Right. That's true. Yeah, I would hope he would come. I, f- I forgot he's from Iowa. Yeah. Dubuque. Dubuque. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Dubuque. Dubuque. I, Dubuque. That's that Dremel's boy. Yeah, G. Graham. Yeah. I think that dresser might be – he, he might be the most underrated coach when it comes to heavyweights, no? Well, I mean, look at Slav, too. Now, Yari, I mean, you guys – I mean, that's a, one of Dremel's boys. Now that he fell through at Michigan, you guys could get him, right? Dremel used to train with him at – when he lived up in Boston. I mean, we got Nate Schoen, too. He's no clown. Play the play a little thing there for him. Nate Schoen ain't, ain't playing around either. Ask the Iowa bench. Right, <laughs> they know. They felt him. They felt him. 